Welcome back to the Beehive Blitz. There's a couple of teams in the western part that have <laughs> quietly turned in some undefeated seasons. Yeah, Stansbury, one of them. The Stallions were 6 0 headed into tonight's monster showdown against Cedar Valley. Stansbury with the ball. Quarterback Ezra Harris gets sacked by Joel Mayo. The Stallions with third and long now. Harris finds Mason Park. 25 yard pickup. Gets the first down, and that would set up Park from seven yards out. Touchdown right here for Stansberry. Cedar Valley trying to hang in, though. Their quarterback, K.J. Fisher, scores from nine yards out, but Stansberry ends up blowing them out of the water. The final in this one, 46-7. Harris, two touchdown passes, one rushing touchdown for the now 7-0 Stallions. Well, yee-haw, how about them Grantsville Cowboys? 6-0 going into tonight's game against Ogden. Quarterback Hunter Bell fakes the handoff, keeps it himself, goes 13 yards for the score. Cowboys off and running. Grantsville gets it back. They're back to punt, but it's a fake. Gabe Maritzen, the upback, takes the snap and runs for a first down. That sets up Maritzen doing it again right up the middle. Six-yard touchdown run. The Cowboys in control. Second quarter now. It's more of Maritzen around the edge this time. He's going to go 10 yards for the score. And the undefeated Cowboys stay undefeated. The final score, 49 nothing. Hunter Bell, four touchdown passes and a touchdown run for Grantsville. Some fireworks at Bountiful as the Region 5 title could be on the line. Whoa. Bountiful hosting Box Elder. The Red Hawks try the screen pass. Owen Gilman to Jacob Brooks. Incomplete, but it's ruled a backwards pass. The ball is live. Bountiful finally recovers, but wow, a big loss on that play. Fourth quarter, the B's driving. Ryan Griffin with a swing pass to Easton White. He heads for the end zone, but he stopped just short by the bountiful defense. After penalty moved them back five yards, it's Griffin in trouble, scrambles, and his pass batted down by Tyler Black. That was big because Tyler Fox Elder had to settle for a field goal, and they ended up losing by one. Bountiful wins at 14 13. The Red Hawks get the game winning touchdown pass to Brigham Morrison with 228 left in the game. A thriller. And last night in Cache County, Green Canyon hosting Ridgeline. The Riverhawks take a 14-0 lead when quarterback Nate Dolly hits Carson Cox from 38 yards out. Ridgeline in control, but the Wolves get back to it on special teams. The punt is basically caught by defense alignment <laughs> Will Wheatley. So Thank you very much. Touchdown, but Ridgeline <laughs> holds on. Will Ripstein pounds it in from a couple of yards out, and the Riverhawks Pull out the win. The final score, 21-14. JT White added a two-yard touchdown for Ridgeline. We're going to have all the scores and highlights on our website, abc4.com. One of the scores will be Springville beating Wasatch, by that the way. That will be up there. Go Red Devils. ABC4 News will be right back. <laughs>